all right guys welcome back um this is gonna be my first ever trailer fest i'm gonna call it um like a trailer festival um this is what i'm gonna call it where we're gonna have a bunch of episodes i mean trailers that are uh coming up um and what is gonna happen is that how we're gonna do this is we're gonna record all the episode like all the trailers for this week on possibly a Wednesday, possibly a Tuesday, possibly any day that I feel like it will go. Right now I'm going to work it as Wednesday, but it might change around um cuz Tuesday uh it would work more and I could rhyme it or Thursday, for example. Um I'm working on the kinks for it. Um if you have any ideas for different names for it, we can always try out something else but right now i'm doing trailer festival um and basically we have five trailers to look at now some of them are more obscured than others one is like a generic action movie but i just like one of the stars in it so i'm gonna watch it um and then there's another one that um is a lionsgate movie uh and I'm really, I'm really excited for that one. Um, it looks good. Um, like all these synopsis are good. There is two of them that are a big franchise. Um, and one of them actually, I never have done anything on the channel like this before. But we are gonna do an animation trailer. I don't think I've done an animation trailer if I'm not entirely sure. But we're going to do an animation trailer for the first time ever um, for a movie that I thoroughly enjoyed when I was younger. So <laughs> I probably would like this one. <laughs> um, I don't know, man. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to split it up. So uh, probably the best is going to save for last. And what we're going to do is we're going to have two the two known trailers in between and then the three other trailers started so like right now i'm probably going to start with the first one that is actually shown on my screen right now on youtube so i'm just going to get it over with we'll get that one done and then we'll work on the other ones so this is miller's girl um now this is what jenna ortega it just released today the trailer um I don't have any idea what this is about, um, but it's Jenna Ortega. What more can you ask for? So let's <laughs> jump right in to uh, the first trailer of today. Um, Alright, three, two, one, go. What's your name? Tyler Sweet. I'm Mr. Moore. I'm okay. assuming that you got one of these before. I read the whole list. Well, that's just 12 books on that list. Party hard. Oh. oh. What are you going to do? Alright. I'm 18. Okay. Land this thing in the wilds of nowhere, Tennessee. Interesting. Don't you get scared walking through those woods? I'm the scariest thing in there. <laughs> I want you to write a short story in the style of your favorite author. Are you having a special drink for us tonight? No. Uh, uh, no, I'm your prepping her to be here transcendent. Can she say it? Oh, she's talented. Even worse. What are you talking about? I'm going to inspire. But that's not you. Making love you. What? Oh. She's opened her mouth to say something. But the words fell away. Why did you write this? This is inappropriate. Write what you know and what you say. If you don't rewrite this, I'll have to kill you. Oh. I'm doing you. Oh! It's like he's been living in Graceland with a first friend who's also playing in college. You are a 
Tell the adult. Show some responsibility. Remember, I gave you the turn on your future. Get that off. If she can convince him that something happened between us, I can lose my job. Oh, you could win. Jesus. Oh, wow. Oh, How did it start? Okay. All right. I'm going to talk about this. Um, It says, and it's even, it's even in the process of the uh, ending. The, there is complex themes that appear in this film. To access the resources on the subject matter, please check out this w website. Damn, okay. Um, I haven't seen a lot of movies like this. Um, I always seen these types of relationships in TV shows. Um, I seen, I heard there was a short film a long time ago called The Teacher. Um, and, um, then there was a TV show called The Teacher, so I watched the TV show, but I never watched the short film, because it was too small, and I didn't know any of the characters. This one actually looks really good, because the problem is, it's from a different approach. So, basically, it's by, like, um, it's an English teacher. Of course. Always the English teacher. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry. It's always the English teacher sometimes. But it's like the girl is pursuing the guy, but the guy does not. The guy is saying no, like nonstop. But she keeps saying, I I'll tell on you. I'll tell that you're doing some stuff. I'm tell like, like basically, like, like I'll, like, like, like the one thing that you see in this trailer, you see that part where. She says, uh, like, like, I, I, I turned in this paper, and this paper says, um, inappropriate stuff. And she's like, rewrite this or I'll fail you. And he was like, do it, or I, I do it, I triple dog. Like, basically, because the already, the special treatment, um, was given, that could give signs of, like, that that there was something or there was a connection already um so like and i don't know what else is going to be in the film but the only thing that i don't like in this film it's going to be really very 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 uncomfortable because the guy is like 50 and jenna ortega is like 20. that is going to be the most uncomfortable thing that i have experienced in a trailer um ever and i don't like i know it's just a movie but i know martin freeman and dude is not like anywhere near jenna ortega's age um i think jenna ortega might be 21 but th even if that's punished in the limit because the character is supposed to be 18 um and she's saying even in the beginning of the movie that what is an adult and then on top of it other things i don't want to get too far into depth with this movie um i gotta do something real quick and i'll be right back i'm gonna edit this part out but i'll be right back um so this is part of the trailer <laughs> uh festival i have to edit a little bit but oh well um hope you guys enjoy let's check out in dune 2 i think we were gonna say that already so um this is trailer three here we go <laughs> Fighting the argument for decades. Mom. Our family's been fighting this for centuries. Your blood becomes hot cakes. Then great houses. 
here and equal. What we do, what we do for the benefit of all. Wow. Well, I'd very much like to be equal to you. I know. Oh. Okay. Kneel with this talk. Tell us nothing. Lady Robin, he's quite calm. Interesting. Your possible future, all at once. And there's so many thinkers. I mean, for now, I do see the light. There is a narrow way through. I always think it's for you. You believe me? This is a form of power that our world has not yet seen. The ultimate power. I want you to know I will love you as long as I believe. Hey, don't stop it. Listen, what do you want? Consider what you're about to do, you poor little idiot. I do have one question about this movie. Um, I'm going to watch it for YouTube, but uh, question. Uh, do you need to know everything um, from the book? Because can you just watch the movie and understand what is going on? Or there's so much detail in the book that <laughs> that it's better to watch, read the book. Because like, the book I heard is very long. So like, I... I like, like I, I would like to read the book eventually, but um, if I was to get, if I got interested in this fr franchise, but I don't know if I could do it before the movie. Sometimes I can, um, but depending on how much time I have, um, I prefer to watch it. Uh, uh, I don't know, watch it beforehand. Um, it looks fantastic. The 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 sequences, the cast, um, the cinematography, man. Uh, I don't know what else to tell you. It's a sci-fi uh masterpiece, probably. It's gonna be a sci-fi masterpiece. A lot of people, um, are interested in this franchise. Um, I was told, and a lot of people when they announced this, were excited and went to go see it and. They were surprised by it, um, and it worked. Um, so, and I never seen Ten Timothy Shadow Mander. If I'm hopefully saying that freaking right, I, I'm really, I'm really brain farting names right now. Um, but I never seen him in a movie. Um, seen Zadea in so multiple movies and shows. Um. I mean, just, yeah, but, uh, um, I don't know, man, um, I'm curious for this one, um, but we have another, uh, movie trailer, um, for you guys, let's get into the next one, um, I don't even know what the name is, so we're gonna have to go back and figure out where it is brick yeah this one I think that's the name of it the brick player looks like the most generic trailer forever but let's Go, I guess.
Okay, so this has a Aaron. I I feel like I know him from somewhere, but maybe I don't. Um, but I know one name, Nina. From the Vampire Diaries, we are watching the Vampire Diaries right now. That's why I was interested in it, even if it is a small movie. Um, I know I'm kind of tired, but that's what you get when you do it at 9.30 at night. <laughs> um, but here it is, and um, all its glory, the brick layer. Um, I do have a movie coming out tomorrow, too. So t stay tuned for that, and then I'm going to try my best to get one episode up and record an episode or something like that. We'll, we'll work out something. Um, but here we go. Okay. Okay. What is its function? That's your mission. Can I help you? I'm the bricklayer. Sir, this is urgent. <laughs> what am I looking at? Victor Waddock. We need to bring Vale out of retirement. What do you want? Okay. Can an old friend stop by to say hello? He knows how to blackmail the CIA. We could bring down our entire cable network. Okay. I want you to go to Greece to fix it with her. It's a big assignment for you. First time in the field, no supervisors. I'm your supervisor. Of course you are. <laughs> From the director of Cliffhanger and Die Hard. You stay where you were. Yeah. Now that you're back, well, it's gonna be hard for you to leave again. Play the list. Damn. I warned you not to get involved. You can't hide from me. I'll never, ever stop coming. Are you kidding? <laughs> you gotta be serious. Okay. Going on a manhunt, not building a chimney. <laughs> Never do a job without my. Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely something I would watch. Um, I don't know if I would watch it with you guys. You would have to tell me. <laughs> um, it's a generic action movie. Um, definitely a generic one. Um, uh, it would be funny to watch. Um, um, personally, when I think of generic action movies, um, most of the time it's always just a little bit different. Um, you have this person, and um, he might be a different uh work style, and behind himself he's a CIA agent or uh something happens to a family member or or something and then they go ballistic. This was reminding me a little bit of the new uh Jason Statham movie, um Beekeeper um trailer. That one looks great. Um it's definitely b bigger budget. Um but I don't know, man. I I the only thing that's <laughs> and that's making me want to watch it is Nina, <laughs> because whenever I don't know, I I'm a sucker for uh, uh female uh action stars. I'm sorry, I, I it it just I, I'm a sucker for watching that stuff. I love it, um, but um, I definitely will 
see this because it's I think it's on Netflix. I think it will be coming on Netflix in January. Um when it also comes out on the uh video on the man. I haven't decided if we're gonna do it, but if it's close to not like when I'm leaving, I mean not not when I'm leaving. More when um we're not doing school anymore, then I'll think about it and we'll uh we'll work out something because I have no idea how this would do on the channel, uh, personally. Um, next up is another movie that I know the name of. Um, we all know the name of. Kung Fu Panda 4. Um, this is my first animation trailer on the channel. So, yeah. Let's go. I'm sorry about that, guys. Um, Kung Fu Panda 4 trailer. Uh, we're excited for this. Um, but here we go. It is time to take the next step on your journey. I'm not going to be the Dragon Warrior anymore. You will advance to spiritual leader of the Valley of Peace. Inner peace. Inner peace. Keep your surf off my turf! Dinner, please. Dinner with peas in a sesame soy glaze. This is not working at all. <laughs> tai Lung, big fan. Once I possess the kung fu of every master villain, no one will dare question my power. Not even the great dragon warrior. Who's that? The most powerful shape-shifting sorceress, the chameleon. How do I find this, the chameleon? I'm gonna lead you right to her front door. Yeah! It was against an army! <laughs> Then we'll just have to get an army of our own. What is this place? The best crooks and criminals live here. You're a wanted criminal? You sound surprised. Is it surprising? Now you kids be careful of those fireworks. Ah! Ah! Violence makes our tummies tingle. Why should we help you? We can take down the chameleon together. Being the dragon warrior, it's who I am. Skip me. What do I know about being a spiritual leader? What is it you're holding? A cookie? Ah! You were chosen to become something more than you already are. <sighs> How should we do this? Quick and painless? Yeah, 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 yeah. Or slow and painful? Slow and painful. <laughs> Finally met your match, Chameleon. We're not so different, you and I. Skadoosh. Stand back. I'm gonna kick my butt. I'm gonna debunk this name. I'll try it. Aquafini. Hopefully, I'm saying that right. I'm not gonna really um per de debunk it, but I'm trying my best. Um, she is from um the Ryu and the Last Dragon. Um, and she was in Shang Chi. Um, she, she was the dragon in Ryu and the Last Dragon, and and Sun Chi, she was one of the other, like she was like, uh, Sun Chi's best friend. Uh, she's really going up there in movies lately, and I really like her style. Um, she, I think, is the best friend of a uh, a uh, Poe. 
in this movie, like the one that's telling her him all about um the the chameleon. I think that is it. I did not see where who is the person that um plays um he's short round. Um there he he was cast in this movie. Um I didn't see who he was gonna be. He might be the guy that um that uh that was talking to those kids um it's a slow and painful dude that that line is gonna be so funny in theaters for adults because it was just like i was just like damn this is dark because <laughs> he's like i like violence and i was like oh <laughs> that was a little bit dark um i did like um the funny um jokes in there um I, I still laughed at like the fart joke and, and stuff like that and the kick to my butt and um other things. It was funny. I, I, I enjoyed it. It's Kung Fu Panda. It's Jack Black. Like you can't get much better than that. And he hasn't been he hasn't reprised his role since the third one and that was like two thousand sixteen if I if I looked up the um idea of it like it, it hasn't been it has almost been a decade since uh we saw another kung fu panda so um to see him come back and reprise that role and then all the other actors to come back um i don't know how many of the actors are coming back um but i did see um i didn't see the monkey um i know that he's coming back jackie chan um and I did see um, the master. Um, I didn't see the tiger and other people, but it's kind of cool that the chameleon is like taking the souls of the other foes uh, that he used to have. Um, so that's kind of interesting. So uh, um, I, uh, we have one more. Um, this one is one of one of my most interested ones out of all of them. Um, uh, the trailer, I did not see the trailer yet, but, uh, it's, uh, I looked it up, um, cause I was interested a little bit, um, the, the idea is that it's the Civil War, but in the near future, and it's A24, and who doesn't love A24 movies, um, so, we're gonna check that one out, and also, um, a character, actor from, like the past that I have not seen in that many movies lately, um, is coming back. Like I haven't, like most of her movies, I think it is, it's not me. It's more that she has been in so many movies after the, the movie that I'm thinking of that are kind of like, not like my style of a movie. So, so it was different to, um, see that she is coming back um, in like an action thrower or a thrower in general. So um, here we go. Um, this is uh, Civil War and um, Kristen is in this from Sam Sam Raimi's uh, uh, Sam Raimi's uh, um, um, Sam Raimi's uh, Spider-Man movies. Um, Mary Jane Watson um, is in this movie, and we are actually watching those movies right now on the channel. Um, I think we finished two of them. Um, I don't think the second one is up um, right now, but um, we're going to get that up eventually. Um, and then we also have the third one that we have to do eventually. <laughs> but um, here is Civil War. Um, here we go. Let me make sure I'm recording because I've been like checking and making sure. Three, two, one, go. Nineteen states. Oh. 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 With what we see on the news, seems like it's for the best. Jesus. Okay. Citizens of America, the so called Western forces of Texas and California. 
has suffered a very grave defeat at the hands of the United States military. Okay. Mr. President, do you regret the use of airstrikes against American citizens? The movie to be seen today. We need to go down there. They speak journalists on site in the capital. Have no thinking. You think this is death? What is Every time I survived the war zone, I thought I was sending a warning home. Don't what? Do this. But here we are. There's some kind of misunderstanding here. What? So you're American, okay? Okay. What kind of American are you? Huh? You don't know? Oh my god. <laughs> The Western forces will reach the White House on July 4th. Oh my God. Get in the car! Get in the car! Move, move, move! You're gonna hang back. I'm not hanging back. One nation. Oh my God. Under God. Indivisible. With liberty. And justice for all. God bless America. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm going to see the theaters. I don't care what the situation is. It is a little bit political, but I had goosebumps when um Nick Overman, I think that's the president. Um when I looked at the trailer, um, uh, I, I hope I'm saying that right, um, when he was the president, uh, and he was given the speech, and he was saying the, the Pres of Allegiance, dude, I had goosebumps at that moment, like, I have never had goosebumps for the Pledge of Allegiance to the flag, um, it looks like there's two stars on the, um, the banner, um, I'm wondering if that means that, um, um, I'm wondering if that means, um, that there's the Western Alliance and then there's the, I think there's a Western Alliance and the Florida Alliance. I don't know if that, I heard something about that, um, and the two stars mean that on the flag and there's an uprising on the Western front front. And then there's an uprising on the Florida uh, alliance, and they're both fighting each other, um, and and the military is trying to stop it, um, but they're killing civilians, which is what? This is going to be the most thriller type of movie, and so on top of it, they're saying that in the trailer that the journalists are going to the Capitol, and um. If they go to the Capitol, they get shot on sight. That is insane. Just journalists. Like, pull blisters. Just to ask questions. Um, of what is going to go on. What, like, imagine getting... Dude, this is frick. This, this whole movie synopsis is just crazy. Like, this is the type of, these are the type of movies that A24 makes, and I love them. And, oh my god, man. Jesus Christ. Just imagine that. One nation under God. And he, and he said, God bless us all. Like, that's literally what he said. And then we had that shot of all of the, like, the cap, like, like, the, the capital getting bombed. Um, you see, like, everything in Washington, D.C. is destroyed. Like, most of the stuff is destroyed. What is this movie? And I was trying to figure out what the synopsis is, because they're very, like, how do I explain it? They're very kind of, um, trying to keep it vague, um, even on the synopsis page, um, uh, from what I read before we, like, we watched this, um, because I was curious a little bit, um, 
it doesn't even give you a a plank a, like a idea of what the movie is about. It only gives you an idea, but it doesn't tease anything. It doesn't tell you why or how or what is the reason. Um, so this seems like my type of movie, man. This seems like my, my type of movie where I would just enjoy this in the theaters and love every minute of it. And A24, man, I, I, I can't say that enough, man. Any A24 movie that you see usually today um, always does a good job at depending on the genre. And I think their rural hits are thriller and horror. Um, they could really do really good things if they get the right people for the right job. Like, they get the right writers. Like, look at the writer for this movie. Um, he did um, 28 Days Later. Um, I think he also directed, is directing this. But, um, or, no. But, uh, but, um, but, like, he's also, I don't know. I don't know if he is. Let me see. I'm curious. Yeah, he's the writer of X Machinery and Met Men and 28 Days. Oh god, he's the writer of Men? Oh god, we're in for we're in for a horror movie almost. Um and then Annihilation with uh Natalie Portman. That was like a kind of sci fi movie. Um we didn't know what the idea was until we finished it. Um, I never seen it yet. Um, but Twenty Eight Days, Men, and X Machinery. God, we are in for a movie if that's the the writer and and the director of this movie. Um, he is going to destroy this movie. Uh, with good like storytelling. Um, I I can't say that enough, man. This is this looks great. I hope you guys enjoyed um this trailer festival thing we are doing. Um if you guys want more, um tell me in the comments below. This is like um what we're gonna so how this is gonna work out, I know I talked a little bit too long, but how this is gonna work out at the I talked about it a little bit, but at the end I didn't tell you one thing that I was gonna do for other trailers if it's a trailer that I want to see like not like like I cannot wait like there's no doubt about it I'm gonna put it up on the the video if I miss a trailer that's when it's gonna go into the um portfolio and possibly be a trailer fest festival um move trailer um because that's what i'm planning on because like for example if it's strange stranger things 5 trailer comes out bro i'm putting that up like the first day if like outer Banks season 4 comes out like that's the same thing like if it's a show that i've been waiting for for a couple of years or i know it's going to be like insane that's it's no doubt about it that it's going to be like a like a day one but this one, most of the trailers that we watched um, for today were actually come. They came out today. I was surprised. Like four trailers came out today, um, and then we also had that Doom trailer. But that's like the one trailer that's like yesterday um, night. But hope you guys enjoyed. I'm gonna record all these sounds, and then I will put it up. Um, I have no idea if I'm gonna do the thumbnail tonight because um, the way I did it last time took me like at least 10 to 15 minutes and i'm tired um but if you guys want more tell me and we'll see you guys in the next one